from a game going on in Pittsburgh. Oh. Oh. Josh Lambo. Cheryl. Oh my god. Your touchdown. Early on, it's the Vikings in the driver's seat. Carson Palmer, a single touchdown pass to this point in that one. And he atones for his miss the first time around as this one is up and good to extend their lead. So we come upon halftime, and it's the visiting Browns with the lead. As we'll send you down to Orlando as we check in with Larry Ridley and our EA Sports Halftime Report. Larry? All right, Brandon, back to you and Charles in a bit. But first, let's get you caught up on all the highlights from the first half. The Ravens haven't played their best football and trail because of it. The Browns have come in and looked good as the road team. And will just keep trying to play hard and maintain the lead going forward. All right, here we go. Let's take a look at some of the highlights from the first half. Midway through the first, Hogan's the target here, and he'll end up at their own 20-yard line before being tackled. Browns on second and seven. They'll go to the ground here, and he'd cut off the nine play drive with a TD. Browns go up by field goal. Third and seven. Steals has got nobody around him on the catch. And he ends up at their own 41 yard line before he stopped on the play. Okay, Larry, thank you. And we welcome everyone back for quarter number three. Both teams appear ready for the fight ahead, and we resume action here in quarter number three. This is fielded at the goal line. Oh, look at the juke. And he'll be brought down at the 23, make it the 24-yard line. Here's the Browns' offense. getting set to start off this third quarter. They built a good first half lead. Now they have a chance to add on to it. And what I'm thinking is that the offensive staff spent the entire halftime just working with them on, here's what we think they're going to do to attack us in the second half. Nice first half that we've had, guys, but be prepared for some change-ups. We're going to see them when we kick it off in the second half. See how they handle any adjustments that might be made defensively. Big yardage there on the scramble. It gets them a first down. Throwing on first down is Mahomes. Flush to his... And no escaping this time as he'll go down. They got him for a sack. Nick Perry in there to get him his second sack now of the afternoon. Okay, was it a breakdown in protection? Did the running back not pick him up? It doesn't really matter. Sometimes it's just a great play made by the defense. Big time sack. And he's going to be out of bounds, but able to take it inside the 40-yard line. That one goes for 24 yards. On any given pass play, you never know exactly where your exit points are going to be. And this play was flushed to his left, still on the run, able to accurately throw the football for a nice first down. Over the middle to Smith. And he's going to be taken down, but not before reaching the 15-yard line. Chewing up big yardage. Another nice gain there. This one goes for 20. Looked like the defense put pretty good pressure on him, but he's able to flush out to his right to try and evade people. On the run, had to get on his horse. Still accurately throws a nice pass for a first down. And it pops free. The collision there jarred the ball loose and brings up second down. That's very well timed there defensively because it's not a bad throw, but the collision came at the exact time he was reaching to bring in the football. Really, really well done. Decent and offense. Still going. Defense, I think you're right. And out of bounds all the way down at the 
two-yard line. A solid pickup of 13 sets him up first and goal. I'd have to say that's a pretty darn good run right there. They had seven, what, eight in the box, still able to burn them. They've got to consider themselves lucky they won't give up a first down and not a touchdown. And this is not going to do it as he stopped at the two-yard line. No gain there, and it's going to set up second and goal. They'll try and run it in with Bell. And he pushes forward but comes up short of the goal line as he'll get a yard down to about the one. Third and goal. Can the offense punch it in here from the one? And not going to be able to push this forward. He runs into a wall right at the line of scrimmage. And a look at Bell, who remains down after that play. Appears to have gotten shaken up. Can this defense hold him out? Here we go now. Fourth and goal from the two. They come out here in the eye. They'll run for it. It's Ingram. Touchdown! And Bell is way into the end zone for 